No matter what you're going through, I know that you can stand. For your life is in. There is power in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is healing in the name of Jesus. There's deliverance in the name of Jesus. Praise the Lord, wonderful viewers. My name is Prophet Dr. Sifas Kwame Pegata Maklo. You are about to watch the principles of the kingdom program. Every day it is happening live at the great city of power. Impossible things become possible. The power of God is at work. Nobody's has become somebody. Those who lost hope in life, when they come to the breaking yoke, God give them hope again. Those who are sick, those who have been crippled by the devil, when they come to the church city of power, God give them their deliverance. Today, after I'm about to watch this program, please, I, I want you, my wonderful viewers, my cherished viewers, to call your friends, your family, your loved ones, connect all of them to this wonderful program. I want to challenge you, before we end this program, Papa, the God of Israel, the I am that I am, will favor you and bring deliverance to you. Hallelujah. I want to preach part five of the program. We must not joke with our prayers. Prayer does many things. Prayer does many things. Prayer brings healing. Prayer brings deliverance. Prayer brings opening doors. Prayer brings divine power. Hallelujah. I want to open your eyes about so many things about prayer. And uh, as you are watching the program, I am preaching part five. We are having our program, night programs that is going on, all night program, all night program. From this month of June to the month of August, every Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, we have an all night service. Watch night service, deliverance night service, breakthrough night service. We come 9 p.m. by 3 we close. From Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, from this month of June to the month of August, every week, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, watch night. And when we close, watch this wonderful buses when you close by three o'clock this wonderful buses you join those from Kanishi, from achimota from Kakwa, all those areas when you close the bus will help you to go back to where you are coming from do you know why things are delayed in your life it's because you don't pray continuously prayer is a commandment jesus commands his children pray without ceasing Pray without giving up. Prayer is a commandment. A man of prayer is the most dangerous and wonderful person. May God bless you. Let's go and watch the program. But I want to remind you, every Sunday, I have oil service. Every Sunday, I pour oil on your head. This is what I do. See, every Sunday, I'm anointing the people. I'm anointing them. It is happening. You see, I anoint them when they go home. Miracle take place. The Bible says, in first Samuel 16 after they received the oil after prophet Samuel poured the oil upon the head of David he became a king and those time man of God didn't pour the oil on David David never killed a human before I've been mean, always killing animals but after the prophet oil on him chapter 17 of first Samuel he have an encounter with Goliath Goliath and not only Goliath or the Philistines he 10,000 of them praise the Lord that means that you need the oil to break through which that wizard in the family that occult man fighting your destiny the prophet must pour the oil on you for you God bless you every Sunday every Sunday morning I come to Kufuria Kufuria branch every Sunday morning from 6 to 9 a.m. I'm in Kufuria by 10 I am in and so all those in Kofoudia around all meet the prophet in bedtime hotel. When you reach Kofoudia, you just ask for bedtime hotel. Ask the drivers, they'll show you bedtime hotel, bedtime hotel. They are conference hall, very big hall. That's where every Sunday it is happening. I would love to meet you. 
I would love to meet you. And every Tuesday night, I have a watch night service with Cove Town. Every Tuesday night, Tuesday night from 10 p.m. to 3 o'clock, the same bedtime hotel, night service, deliverance service. Ushemia, Kofurudia, Mesemia, watch the all night service of Kofurudia. Only a Tuesday night, Tuesday night, you want 10 p.m. be fiacra ever our life. Nemusia, deliverance service, and pipe po, and come share. I are a sa, a bayou juma. God bless you. If you program, no, if you be. I love you. Keep watching. Lift up your two hands and say it after me, Jesus. I say what is I love you. You are my father, my healer, my deliverer, my provider. Without you, I am nobody. Without you, I have no life. Without you. I have no grace. It is through you I receive grace. And today I am a blessed man. Pass through your word. Change my life. Give me a living testimony. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Celebrate him. Oh, we sing Celebrate him well. Celebrate him well. Celebrate him well. Break it up! Fire! 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 Shout! I am a winner! I am a winner! Hallelujah! We must not joke with our prayers, part five. Prayer does everything. Prayer is the key. Prayer is the key. A child of God who don't know how to pray cannot stand firm and he cannot shine. The principles in the kingdom. As I said, every kingdom has a principle. So Jesus was teaching his disciples how they must pray. Because prayer is important in our Christian journey. So he told them, man ought to pray always okay. without fainting. Look at one. Mm. Men ought to pray always. What you do always means the thing is important. You learn always. It means learning is important. You bath every day means bathing is important. You eat every day means eating is important. You wash your dress every day means washing your dress is important. You cover yourself every day. You dress every day. Anybody who you see him not dressing every day, it means the person is out of his senses. It means dressing every day is important. When you walk out naked, people see you as a mad person. And because you don't want people to see you as a mad person, when you wake up in the morning, you dress. So that means dressing is important. What you do every day, the thing is important. And so Jesus see prayer as important. So men are to pray without ceasing. So David being a cowboy, he became great because prayer became his lifestyle. When prayer becomes your lifestyle, you are powerful. When prayer becomes your lifestyle, you are great. When prayer becomes your lifestyle, you are dangerous for the enemy. When prayer becomes your lifestyle, you become a spiritual being. Prayer is important in our Christian 
life. So when believers are joking with prayer, it means they are joking with their life. Prayer brings protection. A man who prays always, demons are afraid of him. Prayer is important. That is why David said something. David can say me say. In Psalm 55 verse 17. Psalm 55 verse number 17. In the morning will I pray. On a pamer bon paye. Afternoon will I pray. E we amer bon paye. Evening will I pray. E nous besoin tu as so. Prayer is the key. And pabon is safwa no. You should not joke with your prayer this year. E nous pabon ni agrafi. A man of prayer is the most dangerous person. O pia wa bon paye bia hu hu. When you pray, your grounds become fatter. O bon paye wa sa sia from from. Prayer opens the heavens. And pabon bia wa soro. And it releases blessings upon your life. James 5 17 and 18. Mm. Bible said, and Elijah was a man like me and you. He prayed that it should not rain for three and a half years. And the heaven responded to the prayer. Now, the heaven responded to the prayer. Verse 18, and he prayed against the wind, and the heaven responded to the prayer. 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 And the heaven responded to the Joke with our prayer. Prayer is the key. Prayer brings healing. And Pablo the Sanaba. If you don't pray, one month prayer. Sickness can be triggered into your spirit. Yeah, but my toy, I'm only pretty. Sickness can kill you. Yeah, dear, but make you. Millions of people have died with a demonic sickness. Domina, the Adam on the Yadena Co. A man of prayer, a woman of prayer, sickness from the devil cannot enter into your life. What you pray, be a one month prayer. That means when you pray continually, sickness cannot remain in nobody. So the wonderful medicine or weapon that we use to overcome sicknesses is prayer. Prayer is fire. A man of prayer. His tongues become fire. When you pray a prayer, 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 pray. Your tongue tends to become Holy Ghost fire. Fire to kill enemy. A man of prayer, when he's praying, fire comes out from his mouth. And so you must not joke with your prayer. As you are praying here, I pray here, yeah, and I send fire to your hometown. You can pray and a shrine in your hometown can catch fire. As you stand in a cry here, you open your mouth, fire. Be on fire. And fire can go to your hometown. A man of prayer. A woman of prayer. When you are praying, fire comes out from your mouth. I pray for all of you. Today, as you pray, fire come out from your mouth. In the name of Jesus. Prayer destroys demonic things. If you can pray, you will destroy every demonic change. I used to tide you spiritually. Many of you have been changed spiritually. It is only prayer that can break the change. Prayer breaks change. Prayer destroys demonic cause. That is why Paul said in Silas, we are in prison. They chained them. Peter was in prison. They chained him. But through prayer, all the chains. Destroy into pieces. So when you are praying, your money is fire. 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 Open doors. And closed doors. Prayer will open it. And So Acts 16, 24, 25. Yes. As Paul and Silas pray in the night. All the prison doors open. Prayer is the key. And Pablo is a To this message. And Have confidence in your prayers. Have confidence in your prayers. Oh, hallelujah. Amen.
First John chapter 5, hey. verses number 14. This is the confidence we have in approaching God. Mm. That if we ask anything according to his will, he hear us. So, you must have confidence in your prayers. You must believe that your prayer is working for you. This is the confidence we have in approaching God. The confidence we have by coming to his house. If they call for prayer, we have this confidence that as we approach the throne room of grace, he will hear us. And as we pray according the, to his will, he answer all our prayers. So have confidence in your prayer. A man without confidence can never finish his assignment on earth. Write it down. But a man without confidence can never finish his assignment on earth. Write it down. A man without confidence can never finish his or her assignment on earth. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So you must have confidence in your prayers. When you are praying. Let your confidence level become very high. Don't doubt your prayers. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There were thousands of people you doubt your prayers. Mark 11, verse 23 to 26. I'll give you some powerful revelation in that scripture. My son, read very fast for me. Hallelujah. Mark chapter 11. Verses Verse number 23, 23 to 26. 26. For verily I say unto you, Go ahead. That whatsoever shall say unto this mountain, that whosoever shall say unto this mountain, Be thou removed, and be thou cast into the sea, and shall not doubt in his heart. And lie and shall not doubt in his heart. I would not in Dante when I come in. Go ahead. But shall believe that those things which he said shall come to pass. He shall have whatsoever he said. When you are asking God to do something for you, doubting is a weapon that Satan used to stop your prayers. People are praying. Let me also pray and see. You can say I am praying to see. You are praying for things to happen. I prophesy over your life. Before we finish this fasting and prayer, or this all night service, may all your prayers be answered. I say, may all your prayers be answered. And shall not doubt in his heart. But shall believe those things which he says. Uh -huh. Shall believe in those things which he said shall come to pass. And shall have whatsoever he said. So if you ask that God change my life this year and your confidence level is high, God will change your life. So when you pray, believe it is working. Don't doubt your prayer. 24. 24. Therefore, I say unto you, mm -hmm. whatsoever you shall ask of the Father, mm -hmm. in the name of Jesus, what things soever you desire. Now me catch some say, and then be able to move somebody. Do you have a desire? What will come as what day? What do you want God to do for you? Then a person am in your mouth. Ask ask somebody. Ask somebody. Bisso be bisso be. What things soever you desire. And then be able to move pen. When you pray. Mobampaya. Believe that you receive them. And you shall have them. Ah, you see why? That was not why. Mm. You must not joke with your prayer. And go and follow things that men of God are selling. You must connect yourself to prayer very well. What? Whatever you want in life, when you pray, ask God. Believe Him, and you shall have it. Now, so your prosperity is in your mouth. Write it down.
Your prosperity is in your mouth. Your change and your upliftment is in your mouth. Your greatness is in your mouth. Your house is in your mouth. Your cars is in your mouth. Your traveling is in your mouth. Everything you desire is in your mouth. So when you decide not to open your mouth to pray, you are burning your life, you are burning your, 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 your blessings. So when you call for prayer, you are praying for So when you call for prayer, you must believe that my desire, the things I'm looking for, they are about to manifest. I pray for all of you. May the Lord give you all your heart desire this year. As you join this night of change. Yes, the Lord. Amen. The verse 25 okay. and the verse 26. Uh -huh. It's the weapon Satan is using to fight our prayer life. Now, I'm forgiveness is a canker that destroys destroying your prayer capacity. Now, I'm say unforgiveness. It's a canker that destroys I say your prayer capacity. I won't power one thing. If you don't forgive, you are killing your capacity. You are killing it. You are destroying the warehouse of power. There are many of you are here. So many offenses inside you. So many. Praise the Lord. 25. And when you start praying, forgive. Bam. Question mark. Uh, when you stand praying, forgive. Praise the Lord. Amen. I will not talk to her. I will not talk with him. Who does he think he is? No, no, I will not talk to him. So many offenses. You are against someone in this church. You meet and talk against the person. Always you hold the person in your heart. And you call yourself a Christian. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When you start praying, forgive. If you have ought against any, mm. that your father also, which is in heaven, May forgive your trespasses. Now, obi fumu afate no. Say the more you want to do so, and the more you better move. Verse twenty says, but if you do not forgive, one fancha, neither will your Father which is in heaven forgive your trespasses. Son of a person from one in two. We pray, we pray. Kapa yapa yapa yapa. We don't forgive. It doesn't matter what he has done. Just forgive the person. And found your way here. What do you have against me? I, I've forgiven you. I've forgiven you. I will no more talk about it. I've forgiven you. That is all. Because I don't want to destroy my prayer life. Your mother will love. Your mother will love. Your mother will love. Everything you do no more. Because of unforgiveness. One fine chanty. Sad your way. Such a character. And then my Christo Sumna say. That's the reason. That's the story of the foundation. A teacher. Ah, if you don't forgive, the, the dangerous key there is that the sins you committed before, God can never forgive you. So the only way God can also forgive you, the money you rob from someone, the fornication, the abortion, you have forgotten that you have seen before. And you, you, you are holding someone's sin and you are talking about it. You are talking about it. Forgotten that. You have seen before. You have become hypocrite. Hypocrite don't forgive. They forgot their fault. They forgot that they are sinners. And they are talking about other sinners. Hypocrite. And so because of that, that to be in God's presence is a blessing to carry curse. I can't forgive him. He's not like this. He's not like this. If you forgive your sister, you don't spoil him to someone. Hypocrites have covered the whole church. And they think they are praying. Hey! Unforgiveness makes your life crooked. You have a crooked life. Nothing good will come into your life. 
Your prayers can become only effective. When you forgive. Forgive the person. Me. Me. Forgive the person. He has said something about you but can you you? Forgive him. He's a hypocrite. Watch his future. Saying things about you. What can say? Forgotten that he or she also is a sinner. Hallelujah. The only way you forgive someone is one you to you know that you have seen before. The only way you can forgive somebody and forget forever mm. is one you to you know that hey, I've seen before. Why For that? this sin I've seen before. Sometimes we forgot where God called us from. Then we continue judging people. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Be free with people. Be nice with people. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. First Chronicles chapter 16 verse 11. Look unto the Lord and his strength. Seek his face always. Now, where do we pray? We pray for God to strengthen us. When you are weak, your prayers will not be effective. Let us why we can't be for God. God are I am weak. I pray to you that you will strengthen me. Let me pray for you that you will strengthen me. Let me pray for you that you will strengthen me. Let me pray for you that you will strengthen me. Let me pray for you that you will strengthen me. Let me pray for you that you will strengthen me. Let me pray for you that you will strengthen me. Let me pray for you that then I am weak. We seek the face of God for our strength to be renewed. We come to his house continually for God to strengthen us. Because we are in the evil world. When you are weak, Satan used the weakness of your foundation to destroy your building. When you are weak, spiritually, Satan uses the weakness of your foundation to destroy your building. That business you have built well, Satan will destroy it. Your weakness. So, we we seek the face of God and we seek his strength continually. That is the key. Those who want to change their life must connect themselves to prayer. Prayer not only here. Not when you come here alone. Everywhere you go. First Timothy. First Timothy. Chapter two. Chapter two. Verses eight. Verse number eight. I said, therefore, I want men, men everywhere, lifting up their hands to pray. Therefore, I want the men everywhere to pray, lifting, lifting up holy hands without anger or disputing. Say amen. Men everywhere lifting up their hands to pray everywhere. God is in everywhere. He is the omniscient God. He knows all things. He is the omnipresent God. He is always with us. Praise the Lord. Amen. He is the omnipotent God. He is the all powerful God. So everywhere I thought you see yourself. Lift up your holy hands. I begin to have my prayer. I prophesy over your life that from today, everywhere you stand to pray, may your prayers be answered. Oh, your amen is very weak. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Now, you must lay the foundation of righteousness. Having a right standing with the Lord. It makes your prayers become very effective. The book of Proverbs 15 29. The Lord is far from the wicked. But he hears the prayers of the righteous. Let me add James 5 16 to 8. Confess your fault to one another. Pray for one another. And the fervent prayer of a righteous person availed much. When you lay the foundation of righteousness, and you stand on it to pray, your Prayer becomes so effective. Your prayer becomes Holy Ghost bomb. I prophesy over your life that from today, may your prayer destroy which your kingdom. From today, may your prayer destroy all kingdoms. From today, may your prayer destroy all the shrines in your hometown. From today, may your prayer destroy all the shrines in your hometown. I have for much of your castle. I have for much of your destiny. I swear to you, may your prayer 
crush them oh, and, and destroy them in the name of Jesus from today let your prayer destroy marine kingdom your prayers destroy marine kingdom your prayers destroy marine kingdom from today let the rulers of that nation and your prayers bring them down let your prayers bring them down shout and say yes I believe let your prayers bring them down let your prayers bring them down let your prayers bring them down shout and say yes I believe let your prayers bring them down let your prayers bring them down oh hallelujah let me see what you want to say. Say, Lord Jesus. Kasera di Yesu. Anything fighting my anointing to grow. I give you the memo to say yes. This year. Afi. My anointing must grow. I was saying memo to say yes. My anointing must grow. Memo to say yes. Anything the devil is using. I give you the memo to say yes. Any weapon is using. I could give you the memo to say yes. To fight the growth of my anointing. As I clap my hands and pray. Me pray me say my prayer. That they catch fire. Sado Janto. Ma. Cecia. Ma. Lift up your voice. Lift up your voice. Fighting the growth of the Adi Biada. I know what you are going. Shadiano, blow the fire. Fighting the growth of the Adi Biada. Lift up your voices. Lift up your voices. Who jump on? Who jump on? In the name of Jesus. Break it up. Fire. 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 Righteous prayer availed much. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I am back. You see what I'm telling you? That's what God is doing. The word of life. The word that brings healing. We must not joke with our prayers. Now, I want to lead you to receive Christ. You must give your life to Him. Yes, you must think. When you walk with the Lord, your story change. Say it after me. Lord Jesus. I believe you died for me. You are rose for my salvation. This very hour, I receive you into my life as my Lord and personal Savior. Forgive me all my sins. Wash me with your blood. Write my name in the of life. Amen. God has come into your life. You don't have a church where you understand the word of God, where you'll be moved to pray. Jesus said, my house shall be called a house of prayer. I'm giving you an invitation to one place, city of power, Klago NDC, where people, thousands of people come and receive their healing. Every Friday we have mega all night. In fact, the Friday is powerful. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, we have mega all night. Friday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Wednesday we close 3 a.m. Thursday we close 3 a.m. But Friday we close 4 30 a.m. From this time on to the month of August. I want to meet you. Your life shall never be the same. May God bless you. Now, I want us to go and watch what God is doing. Prophecies, testimony, prophecy, testimony. Very wonderful. Those who run to the house, they worship with us. The wonderful things that God is doing in life. In fact, you'll be moved. you believe God. Everything it is happening. Hallelujah. As you are watching the program, call any of these numbers. When you call, Ask for directions of the church. You are coming to worship. You are coming to worship with us. For God will give you. Praise the Lord. Testimony time. Celebration of Jesus' power. I love you so much as you are watching. But don't forget, Jesus loves you the most. Let's go and watch what God is doing. But as you are watching, call this numbers. The down there, see, it is rolling. The, 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 the FM stations we have been preaching. Oh, write all of them and follow us. Follow us on all the network. On Facebook, on the net, everywhere, follow us. You will love all the sermons that I am preaching. When you go to Facebook, all the sermons are there. When you go to the net, all the sermons are there. May God bless you. Keep watching and write back. Come, Mama, Bra. Follow me. So, Dimitri. Have you been seeing Snake? Hmm? Tuesday. Tuesday. Are you sure? Hey! 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 Is what? Cobra. Cobra? Yes. Eh? Everybody saying? Okuma, Udemu. Udemu. Then they see it. Tuesday, Monday, me free. A year, 
Monday, if you're here, I'll buy Me buy it, Anna Jo. Me die, Anna. Me who say, me who can come? Who can come? I try. Jesus. Until me, me die, Anna. Me who say, me be in Anna. Me who? Until tomorrow. Huh? Cobra. Tomorrow, Anna. Me did die. Until me didn't tomorrow. Yes, say. Until my be mo na me didn't tomorrow. At two me change say. Until me ye boko na me sorry. Until me sorry, Anna. Mammy, because as I am passing here, ah, I saw a snake. So I asked the woman, Are you been seeing snake in your dream? As a prophet. He said, No, prophet, a snake came to my house to kill, want to kill me. And I will ask you a, make sure what you are saying is true. Now you saw the snake in your room. Pachoy. Now, who killed the snake? Me pachoy, me One of whom? Such snake way. Me ba. Snake no song. The the mamani cano. The mamani cano. Ne ne believe you know. How did you kill the snake? I didn't see him come and walk as he. I didn't see him at twelve o'clock. Twelve o'clock. Midnight. Midnight. Twelve o'clock. The snake came to the room midnight. Twelve o'clock. Go ahead. Uh -huh. I didn't know I didn't I didn't I Anti <laughs> Me dinner, me so touch, you know, or trusty touch, you know, me refer her, no, the mechi. Oh, refer her, no, the mechi. Me do the capitana, you to offer her. Snake, the duachi, and I said, what up, so kunu? Me patrai. Open so kunu, and I said, what duachi, sir? Me joani, because my lucky dianunti, mean to me be a dianu, baby, I meet me dim the capabia, no, the mechi. Snake away, me patrai. Anywhere I told you, pass. Uh, no, I have me say, Rady Jimmy. I Rady Jimmy. I Rady Jimmy and I miss some Bible. Any uh, uh, calendar now, I have to last. Uh -huh. oh. I have to say, I have to say, I have to Go ahead. I have to say, Bible, no, me the two, me, uh, me, me, I have to say, 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 I have Baby, I'm a buffer, no, I mean, once a prayer, I'm in a prayer, I'm no, I want to make book it to a be any shema, no, and tell me, yes, I know, me so touch now, no, dimrika, ever, I feel me name, dear mayor, me two Bible now, now was so Bible new, hey, Bible three nina, what matter nina, I miss it, why that? Me two Bible, you say, oh, two Bible, you say, we read no my time Bible no. Me two third second one no so third no so third fee. Me name the Amaya Bium. I feel Mr. Tissu. And I baby I me do the Ukraine me any. No abre. Me name the Amaya Bium. I feel my own say my am. Why am I? Let me say already. Buami. A ready shamidi. A ready shamidi. Shamidi. A ready shamidi. Shamidi. A ready shamidi. And one na mika say me go so bua. Baby, I'm going to say, what's up, my new house? Echo, I'm a farmer. Chi, I'm a farmer. Chi, I feel me name the Amaya Bio. Me name the Amaya Fi. Me do we stick a calendar? Calendar, no. The bow, the bow, bow. I'm patchy. I'm say prophet. We go. I ready. Um, um, na nyami soon soon e wa wosu. Wa me soon. Ah, we di ye chuma. We di ye chuma. Me here time seven. We here time seven. Me casano, 
Afi me hunse. Me hu me ate. Afi e ba me se na otu ku abua no. Me ni light. We are na first eh me fun na me di die. Enti man de pe na me to we enu na e adum a e bo a me tu anajo no. Enti me yes anu na me se urade bua me urade bua me no. I want to know say, I want to be by me. Tell my was on to me, a battle bonus. No, and I'm so my rare fan. So I see, I see one at you. And to look as blade now, me toss a mini bear a window. No windows, look a blade. No, yeah. And I'm a guy say, be be what them. I think me to me, come me coffee. Coffee. I feel me fire. No. What done in you say? What done? What done? Yeah. Hey. I didn't miss you. I feel. Oh, that was so. I feel. I didn't miss you. Miss you already to me. Already share me thing. I know I'm not bad. I'm not bad. I'm not bad. We still have to go meha. Any touch in the pe. And to miss you, you must. We don't just stick at the car anymore. Now we are bad. Yeah. Bad guy. I'm still already to me. What? Mommy, I'm holding on to me. Go away. And to aha. Aha. Ahana, Louvers blade. Udi boy, yeah. Enti ahana piye dada. Enti ahana midi Louvers. Ah, udi udi boy chia se. Ha, niti dia wadi kai. Edi far baby enti. Ah, odi tiri far baby se kai opiye. Ha ha. Ena odi wadi udi boy ha se. Boy ha. Afisi se ano. Odi netu aye se. Aye se. Na odi bosso. Ena mini ano. Ena fi me pe adi a midi be pa niti. Be pa niti. Mini anu anu supreme su mesi mi njia na midi adeni sine. What you be kumsa wohi? Celebrate the woman for me. Midi sine kwa sawa fi me padia. Midi ba kwa niti. Enti misha ebo na midi yame drone. Ena me tu mi santi mi trim mi unse. Enti me padia fa wa window no su. Enti me pe we anu na mi sako sawa ebo anu. Ena midi shi niti. Niti. Niti ba ye. Epa ya nuni misio, enyamre na. Nitia pai. Afi ohri. Ohri. Misu media dini sini sudi. Meba. Meba. Next question. Woku msaa snakei. Epa joy. Epa ni sana wote cha picha wii. Miku ni wiyadi chini. Ena miko pe photographer. Photographer. Se ombe chama mi. Ombe chama. Na di enyami di enyami yimi efri mono. Na mimi fa etsira mansa se. Di enyami tu mi yeni. Di enyami tu mi yeni. Enti. Ha. Enti date wa picha na so. Date ni yadai. Date ni yeye. Twelve. On the twelfth. On the twelfth June. On the twelfth June. Two thousand and eighteen. We enyama zao. Date ni waso. On the twelfth. Ana enti ai. Four. Ana sixteen. And the Tuesday on the twelfth, Wednesday, the four days in here. And the Anukwe. Now, me chemu wa hasei no. Me no ne plan ne yana. Me pacho Debbie. Cash me kau. Dam pacho. What a catch that me. Debbie. Debbie. How would I know it? I was passing, then I saw a snake. I said, "Woman, snake. Snake was saying, 'I am prophet. Snake is following me.'" Me who snake, you know. God spoke to me, sir. They sent this snake to come and kill you. Because the same snake killed someone in your house. The same snake killed someone in your house. And they said it is you who killed the person. And so they send the snake to come and kill him. Mommy, Ufie, Obi, you are home. My father, why? Why are you here? My brother, oh brother, and I call up here midday by Sunday. Sunday, I go to the museum at two minutes. Where you? I bought free beer. What near? Midday by Sunday, Sunday be. Sunday be. What did you buy? Sunday waha. I know where you are. Monday, me a basari Sunday call. Monday, me home for me. Home for? And I'm missing me call check up. Abba, till me try home we change about twelve thirty to one. And I'm me cry home. And I a jumai for be 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 here jumai. Me fear. And I'm missing home we change call and I'm missing me call check up. Abba, before me ban on a call a wu a call a ne a wu. Edda ensure be one me fear. Abba, friend, another one to be wu. 
e oba eya mi chiri ba ni ba o chiri ba how many years three and a half years three and a half years o ko take up aba wa to nsuo ma wewu na ho na yi ni fin stone mu ato ho e ne ne bra kitwa na yi no ne bra kitwa na yi ni fin stone to ho three and a half years ndo mo siye no ba twa yes enten ya ko siye no ba ye na me san ba o ko siye ni ba ye no na ba to snake no Well, ente no omo se ono ku abofra no ente omo suma snake na be ku no so asha ne na asha ne mo pe bia ya suma no wa ya boa so on be you will feel ya se if i be a prophet and you are my children may that person die Breaking yoke. In fact, my testimony all is about evil dreams. Amen. I have been going through evil dreams. I mean, dream by sex, sex in the dream. Mm. That's spiritual marriage. For how many years? It's over, let's say, this 22 years. 22 years of spiritual marriage. So, what are some of the damages the dream caused? In fact, it has caused divorce mm. to my marriage, and which is very painful. Mm. I cried a lot. So during, during that time, my children were very little. My first one was nine. My last daughter, being the third one, was five. Mm. Um, another problem, what this thing has caused, is my health. Mm. From my spinal cord to my backbone to my waist, everything. So since I came back, 2014, I have been going up and down. Mm. The first time I heard of breaking yoke, it was in version version one version one okay i heard about a program that was being held here for nigerians i say wow so my people are here and i took the advantage to fellowship here spiritual marriage is a very dangerous something mm. i've been praying for god's deliverance so while i continue coming here last january on the night of january our beloved daddy here located me and he gave me a 21 day fasting program mm. after the direction I thank God he ceased give a mighty hand on to Jesus <laughs> after the direction 22 years of spiritual marriage has ceased give a mighty hand on to the God of the God it's not easy mm. But I really thank God that through his servant it has come to cease. Give a mighty hand unto Jesus. 22 years of spiritual marriage. Through that he lost his marriage. Through that he lost his job. Through that he also had health challenges. But as he came here to the city of power is free from that spiritual marriage. Give a mighty hand unto Jesus one more time. I want to thank God Almighty who has done this thing to me and mm. thank our beloved prophet. Next testimony. Breaking you up! Fire! 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 2014, I was in the world. 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 Now two years, I was in bed with my husband. I was in the car, with my husband. I was in bed with my husband for three months. I was in bed with my husband. 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 Now, two months, three months, Papa can't say, 
Obia mo ndi ope nyama miensa na yenko tochi ni ni na tari enu ni yemfaska na entu ni ni table ne yinisu na konyo anisu nti mi yesa last month ena nyami di nyami yi tren a bim life wa mami tia shortage brand new oh give me a mighty hand She's having a khaki here as an evidence. Celebrate the God of Pega. Brand new 2018. Celebrate the woman here. Brand new car. Yeah, I put two of me in my yeah, yeah, what honey said. Yeah, 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 so my assembly, I be free a point. Abba, who will be you? Who need be you? Would you have any name? Who need be a crowd one? Fabe testing you. No, be a mimi bahano. Na I'm nobody, but ene nyami I am a somebody. Amen. Timi draha na inshirano ewaha. Breaking yo! Fire! 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 My name is Mr. Foley, and the lady beside me is my lovely wife. That's right. Celebrate them. We located Breaking Yoke uh, on the 23rd of September 2016. And that day was an all-night service. In fact, when we came here, uh, I, I saw something that I've never seen before. People were mad with prayers. That's right. So that day we decided to join this church. That's right. So uh, on Tuesday, after that Friday, on Tuesday I was here during the checkup service. So daddy located me and he said, I want to pray for you. So I stood up. And he said he saw one of my shoes in a shrine. Mm. And what it means in the realms of the spirit is that there's no way I can move on in life. Mm. And actually that time, he said the word he used was I was, making, I was marking time. Mm. And I wasn't only marking time, I was standing at ease. Because <laughs> when you are marking time, it involves movement. But when you are standing at ease, there is nothing like movement. So oh, give a mighty him. hand unto Jesus. His life had come to a standstill. Mm, continue. He prayed for me and he blessed me with a mantle. So when I got to the house, uh, just about three days after the prayers, after the encounter with the prophet, mm. I had a dream and I, I saw the prophet. He said, my son, they have buried your success, mm. but I will take you to a particular land in your hometown mm. and you will dig they have buried your sources, so you dig it, you dig your sources out. So I started digging, I started digging, and the place looked like a tomb. So when I was in school, I lost a bag. Miraculously, I saw that bag in the tomb. I saw my wallet, I saw my phone, and I saw other educational materials in the tomb. Wonderful. Give a mighty hand unto Jesus. After an encounter with the prophet, he also had a supernatural encounter in his dream. Continue. That time, uh, lovely people, I was even jobless. So two months after that dream, I had a job. Give a mighty hand. Two months after that dream, he had a job. And also, uh, for some time now, I've been struggling to marry. The more I try the more I failed. It got to a time I went to the family of my wife that I want to do only engagement. Only engagement. Uh, in fact, uh, we set a date aside for the engagement, but that something happened and it couldn't come on. So, in fact, I was, I was confused. But when we came to breaking you, this time it's not only engagement, it's engagement and wedding. Oh, give a mighty hand unto Jesus. Spiritual problems. But today yes. all have been solved and yes. you are married. Yes. Celebrate the God of Kega. He came here jobless. After the prophet had prayed for him, he got a job. He was having difficulty in marrying. Today, all the problems that have become hindrances to his marriage have been solved. And they are married, engagement, and wedding. Celebrate the God of Pega one more time. 
today we give glory to God. Amen. And I also want to use this opportunity to thank the Papa of the house. His ministry has been a blessing to some of us. That's right. Amen. Oh, Wonderful viewers. Yes. May God bless you. Now I want to pray for you. You see how, how, how God is working. They are giving testimonies. Great things are happening. See the woman. How the snake attacked her in the room. It's not wonderful. But how did the prophet know that God is still saying something? God is still performing miracles in people's lives. I'm giving you a special invitation. Breaking Yoke is a place of worship. When you come, decide that you are coming to worship God. And you experience Him. Some come there two years. They are starting to change. One year. They are starting to four years. When you worship in a place where God has taken the seat. Ah, my God. Every yoke shall be destroyed from your life. May God bless you. Now, I want to pray with you. You love the message, what God is doing. What next? I want to pray for you. Touch the television screen. I want to pray for you right now. Father, I pray for my wonderful viewers. Anybody under attack of the enemy, heal the person right now. Receive deliverance. Any sickness in your life, I curse that sickness. From today, may God give you a living testimony. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. I pray for you. You have received your healing. You have received your deliverance. What next? Work out your own salvation with fear and trembling. Right time has come for you to wake up. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, we have a watch night service. So as you are watching me now, the all night is continuing. Tonight it is happening. Every night, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, the year all night is here. Then Sunday, I will anoint you. Every Sunday, I will anoint you to the end of the month of August. People are receiving their testimonies already. I would love to meet you. Your life shall never be the same. I love you so much. Now, don't forget, Jesus loves you the most. Friday, come to one night. Every Tuesday morning, we have a checkup service. Every Tuesday morning, Tuesday, Miracle service, prophetic hour, checkup service every Tuesday, 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. Come with your problem. God will favor you. You don't have a place of worship. Come to break in every Sunday. We have two services one in the morning, 12 will close. Then in the evening, we have a deliverance service. May God bless you. May God favor you. Next week, the same station, the same time. You are blessed. Bye bye. It's the same God who was there for you in the midnight hour. It's the same God who is able to wipe your tears away. It's the same God who was there in time of lack and want. It's the same God, is Jehovah, my great provider. Tell me why you're giving up on God.